Hey, I'm here with Union Catholic star senior Taylor McLaughlin. Just helped UC win their fifth straight Union County Relay title. Taylor, um, big day for you. Seven flat, you ran in the shuttles. You know, you guys won that. 23, you ran in a four by 23 flat and a four by two. You guys won that, and a big 48-8, 400 in the sprint men. I mean, what does it mean to you guys, to you personally? Five in a row, and like we were talking about before, a lot of new guys in this team. Yeah. I mean, a lot of big stars graduated. You're still here with a bunch of new faces. I mean, what's it like just, I don't know, winning this with a bunch of new guys? It's crazy, actually, because like it's something that started before I even got here. Like the year before I came, they won, and it's kind of continuing something that all the guys I've known for the past four years have like work to continue and I get these kids who like don't even know what's going on and they're working their butts off trying to win this title that means so much to me and coach but they don't even know what it means and now when I leave next year they can continue it too and that's really great. Yeah do you feel like you know being a senior leader now and like you said you know Gazone, Gan, Jimerson, you know, Femi, yeah. um, do you have you had to take on more of a responsibility to kind of show these guys what it takes to be champions, what it takes to be I mean, you're, you've been a national champ many times. I mean, what's it like for you as the senior leader now? I mean, I look over at him over there, and, like, I just remember I was in their shoes a little while back, and, like, no one told me, like, exactly what to do because it's something you got to learn for yourself. Like, I can tell them to run hard, but that's something that you just got to learn for yourself. And so I'm just here to kind of help them out along the way, I guess. You're pretty impressed with what these guys are doing. I mean, they've stepped up. I mean, Gosh, you guys ran yeah. 322 last week in a 4x4. Mm -hmm. I mean, and... Uh, I'm watching our 4x8s, and I'm like, these guys are crazy. Like, these are all freshmen and sophomores doing this. It's great. Yeah, I mean, how do you feel about, I mean, you've established a, a great legacy at UC. When you move on and, and these guys take over, I mean, how do you feel about where the program's headed? I feel it's going to a great place because everyone thought, like, oh, we just lost this one group of guys last year. Like, oh, what's going to happen? No, like, these kids are fantastic. Mm -hmm. Like, we lo we got second in the, we didn't lose, we got second in the sprint medley. But I'm like, that was great because Greg ran an awesome leg. And, like, he just ran a great race. He didn't run. He, like, he raced. And, like, that's just, they're going to be great in a few years. They're going to be fantastic. I think you're right. I mean, a lot of people thought you guys would drop off a lot after losing so many guys. But you're still, like, you know, one of the top teams in the state. Uh, which kind of leads me to my next question. I mean, state relays next week. You know, you know all about the rivalry. You've been part of it. You guys in CBA. What are, what are your thoughts just on competing against them next week at the non-public game meet? I mean, it's the same as this one. Just... I really don't mind. I mean, I, if we lose, we lose. If we win, we win. Like, these, it's just for these kids. It's so they can get the experience running a state really meet. So they can know what it's like to compete at a high level. And they can be ready for it next year. Okay. And uh, how about for you personally, before I let you go, I mean, is there a big target for you this indoor season? I mean, uh, you won the meet of champs last year to 400. Um, as far as a time, or what, what are you targeting? What's your number one goal this indoor season? Taylor? This indoor season, I mean, time-wise, it's just like maybe I want to run the 300 again. I think we're planning to do that at one of the meets. I'm not sure if I'll get to, but if I can, just maybe pick up my time on that, bring it closer to Zaire's time from last year. 400 time, obviously, try and get that as low as possible for the outdoor season, and just try and really stay healthy for outdoor season, because that's where it all takes off. You know? All right, I heard from Taylor McLaughlin, one of the big stars today for UC, helping his team win their fifth straight title. Keep your eye on Taylor. Michigan's getting a great one. Great job, Taylor. Thank you.